Hello everyone, I'm Aurélie Polis. I am TIST at the Luxembourg Institute of Health and it is my pleasure to present our work entitled Allergic Airway Inflammation Delays Glioblastoma Progression and Reinvigorates Systemic and Local Immunity in Mice. Our research is built on numerous epidemiological studies suggesting that an history of allergy reduces the risk of tumor development. These inspiring the field of allergo-oncology. Here we focused on glioblastoma, the most frequent and deadly malignant brain tumor where both adverse associations are shown to be really strong. However, so far the mechanism in this association remains poorly explored. Since glioblastoma remains unfortunately incurable, our aim is to decipher how allergic airway inflammation can impact glioblastoma with a hope to ultimately translate our findings into new treatment modalities. To explore this, we um, developed a MOS model of allergic airway inflammation using host dust mite as allergen before the intracranial implantation of MOS glioblastoma cells. And thanks to this model, we found that allergy delayed tumor engravement in the brain and reduced tumor growth and those resulting in increased animal survival, as you can see in this Kappelmeyer curve. So then, thanks to this model, we then question if allergic airway inflammation could potentiate anti-tumoral immunity. And to investigate this, the spleens from tumor-bearing mice were collected to perform immunoprofiling of T-cell subsets using flow cytometry. Interestingly, we observe that allergy increased the pool of circulating effector memory T cells, and in parallel, the immunoprofiling of the tumor microenvironment uncovered microglia with a phenotype of antigen presenting cells, as well as the infiltration of CD4 T cells and neutrophiles. So, to conclude, our study shows that allergic airway inflammation limits glioblastoma progression in mice. These provide a preclinical model to study the impact of allergy on glioblastoma progression. And via this model, we already try to decipher on the mechanism and we identify a potentiation of local and systemic immunity, suggesting a reciprocal cross toll that like orchestrate allergy induced immune protection against glioblastoma. With that, I would like to gratefully acknowledge the generous support that made this study possible and I would like to thank you for your attention.